Morning everybody. Looks like we're back in the kitchen and I'm going to teach you how to supercharge a breakfast burrito. Came up a couple of days ago, why not have caffeinated burritos for breakfast, right? We drink coffee, we, um, it's pretty much coffee, right, for breakfast. So we drink coffee for breakfast, but we're not really getting any caffeine out of our foodstuffs. So I'm going to show you how to um, caffeinate a, a breakfast burrito that you would get at any fast food establishment. It's not about sausage biscuits today. So if you were tuning in looking for a sausage biscuit video, this isn't it, partner. You're going to start with a cast iron skillet and you're going to take the burrito and just kind of peel it open. They already got a lot of good stuff in here. And everything that's like cheese and eggs and uh, I think there's some sauce there is some sausage in there going to take a little bit of instant coffee I chose this brand because it has flavor crystals you can actually see the crystals in there and that's pretty tough to compete with so you're going to take a teaspoon of this and then you're just going to Sprinkle it in there. Sprinkle that into the burrito. Make sure it kind of covers everything, right? But, what's a burrito without some beans? So, I'm going to take some whole coffee beans and I'm just going to kind of line the burrito like that with the coffee beans, right? And we're just going to, I don't know if we can get that all in there. Just going to go ahead and fold that back over, all right? Lift it out of the skillet and put it back in the wrapper. Set that down in your skillet for a second. Now, you've got the burrito in a wrapper and a skillet. I want you to take that out, put it in the microwave. You're gonna to wanna to leave it in there for a little while so that the, the caffeine and the flavor of the coffee can mix with the eggs and the sausage and everything. So I'm recommending starting with 20 minutes and then checking at the end of 20 minutes to see if, uh, if that's happened. I don't think I've ever actually cooked anything in 20 minutes before, but let's see. So we're going to give that a little bit of time and then we're going to come back and uh, finish our meal. 20 minutes later. Let's see how we're doing. Use something to grab the burrito with. I can actually feel my fingers burning through the cloth. Unwrap your burrito. Mmm, my mouth actually on fire. It tastes terrible, but. I can feel the rush. Ah. Mm. It's like a coffee explosion.